the pink convict cichlids are dead. Hi, my name is Nuka. Judging by the title, you may believe that the pink convict cichlids are dead. Well, they actually are not dead. So if they're not dead, then where are they? As I have told you in a previous video, I have moved three of the pink convict cichlids into the aquarium at the Bothwell Bridge Hotel which is the 108 gallon aquarium that's the one that measures 8 feet by 16 front to back by 20 high the rest of the pink convict cichlids I did I'm not going to lie and I'm not going to hide anything I did lose about three of the pink convict cichlids that were in here but the rest of them after a uh, a little while of having them I changed my mind I was initially going to start breeding them and that was like the purpose of why I was holding on to them but I changed my mind uh, I was quite happy just to keep three of which are three that are still alive and doing well in the 108 gallon aquarium so the, the rest of them that were in here I took them to one of my LFS and the intentions were well, just really to get rid of them but then I saw this convict cichlid behind me and so I could not obviously help myself I did a straight swap I will get out of the way so that you can see the convict cichlid but I did as well get rid of the pike cichlids that I had in here also the two rainbow cichlids I had they are gone too so without no further ado I will move out of the way and bring the camera closer for you to have a look at the fish in, in here stay tuned so this is the new convict I have actually had this one for about a month and a half, two months now. Let's just round it off uh, to two months. Why not? Like I said, I got rid of the pink convict cichlids, I got rid of the pike cichlids, the rainbow cichlids in here still have three Nicaragua cichlids which I told you about in the previous video there are two Nimbacramis venustus a male eye biter and two female eye biters I have a short video that I will be uploading after this one you will not see me in that video at all but that is uh, just to share with you I had captured a moment where the male eye biter was trying to mate with one of the female eye biter but they kept on being rudely interrupted by the other fish and the male was starting to get quite angry with the, the rest of the fish so this is just a brief update of what's happened to those fish that were in here before so we can say that thankfully they are not all dead and they are all in fact still at the LFS and they are doing well they have grown since I got rid of them but this is what's happening here with this aquarium here 
and the reason for this is because I had to free up some space in the aquariums in the fish room because I had come to know that my friend at Waterworld Aquatics eventually managed to get the Red Empress cichlids that I have been looking for as you know for some time now so yeah ironically I had called him and I'd ha I had asked him this was after he had came back from his holiday he had went on holiday in the summer and I allowed a month to go by a month and a half to be exact to go by and then I'd called him and I'd asked him how was the holiday and how are the family doing well that's you know that's good glad to hear that and then I, I asked him if there's any chance if he may chase up to any of his suppliers on the Red Empress and he said well funny enough they have arrived unexpectedly so I said okay well I will come tomorrow this was then so now I'm talking about past tense I will come tomorrow and I will get the uh, the Red Empress so I so that very day I was busy freeing up all the aquariums in the fish room here and I had these eye biters were in the black storage box which is actually just beside me here you may remember that black storage box that I was using as a grow out box it's still here it's still running so I moved them from there into here so when I went to the LFS I did get in fact six red empress I lost one of them after about two weeks sadly they developed a, a fungal a fungal infection and I lost one of them two are still doing well in the black storage box and three are in another aquarium here in the fish room so if you'd like to see them you'll most likely see them in another video because I'm not showing them in this video that's right it gives you an excuse to come back and watch that's if you want to of course but you're always more than welcome to come back here I'm just kidding I'll show you them now stay tuned so that's two there and the other one is in there hiding at the moment I believe if only it would stay still so I can actually get a better focus in for you oh yes and this is the female electric blue hap she is carrying just wanted to share that with you while well, I'm looking at the tank anyway so in here is where the other two red empresses that's one of them coming out to eat I believe that's actually grown I have also been on holiday for two weeks so coming back and looking at the fish it seems like they have grown I don't know if you can actually see it I can see it but I don't know if you are able to see it it's quite dark isn't it in here now in here there should also be two red spotted severums oh that's one just coming out there excellent yeah and I saw another one under that stone there that's it there just peeking its head out there don't know if you can see it so they are doing well too that's good I was worried because being on holiday for two weeks and not even coming to uh, see my parents I was also one wondering if they fish were all doing well 
but thankfully I had a helper my brother was looking after these fish he was doing water changes and all is good and I think I need to do a water change now anyway I will just put top back on okay so that's the update about what's been happening with this aquarium here obviously like I said the pink cranberry cichlids are not dead yes! and I just wanted to share as with you as well that I eventually managed to get my hands on some red empress I know I had mentioned that in a previous video or at least I remembered mentioning that in a previous video perhaps I even ended up editing it out while I was editing the video and working away on the videos but I, I really do not remember uh, if I, I did or not and of course I never even checked you know so if you have enjoyed watching this update be sure to leave a like hit that thumbs up if you're new to this channel and you do not want to miss out hit the subscribe button activate the notifications to receive notifications on this channel thank you for watching and with this being said you know what I'm going to say next bag of fish take care bye